we're always hunting ass, but uh, man, we crossed a lot of stuff off that list. Uh, we got all sorts of ass, all sorts of all sorts of shit. No, so we've got all we got a whole lot of ass. Uh, last video, and um, it was good. It was real good. <laughs> Yo, what's going on, people? Century Mad Collector here, back again with another video. We're back on the hunt. Are we ever really off? We're never really off the hunt, but uh, as the old adage goes, we are back on the hunt once more. We were able to cross a whole lot of stuff off that list with our last hunt. If you haven't seen that, be sure to go check that out. I'm actually going to link that into the description below. Um, we're always hunting ass, but... Uh, Man, we crossed a lot of stuff off that list. Uh, we got all sorts of ass. All sorts of, all sorts of shit. No, so we've got all, we got a whole lot of ass. Uh, last video. And um, it was good. It was real good. So anyway, um, this is going to be one video where I actually am going to say I don't need NECA TMNT. Well, that's a lie. I do need NECA TMNT. I just don't need it from Target. Um... So, yeah. But anyway, uh, we are going to... So the battle plan a week or so ago was we're hitting all these Walmarts. They're clearly in resets. I need, to, I need to get away from them. Refocused attention on target. That seemed to go pretty well. We're on a hot streak. We're hoping to continue that hot streak. And I figured one week later, which is now, uh, we'd go check back on Walmart. So um, we are on the hunt at Walmart to start this hunt uh, video. We're gonna hit a couple of Walmarts. We haven't been to in a little over a week now, week and a half or so. Uh, we are on the hunt for all sorts of Marvel Legends. Um, Spider-Man Retro Wave, we need Green Goblin and Electro. I really love those figures. I wanna see them, hopefully. Uh, I was able to, I was lucky enough to, to grab Spider-Man, uh, Daredevil and Gwen. Um, almost a month ago, so, but yeah, so we need Green Goblin and Electro and Peter Parker, uh, Deadpool, uh, Strong Guy Wave, haven't seen them yet, it would be nice to see something, I at least want that blue Deadpool, I'm pretty, I don't know if I'm gonna get the whole wave or not, we'll see, um, I do really like Strong Guy, he looks good, but, uh, I would at least like to see that wave, haven't seen that yet, um, G.I. Joes, still need Snake Eyes, uh, got a whole bunch of them also in the last couple of hunt videos, but we also need Beachhead. Um, he's probably, he may be my favorite. He looks amazing. We need him. And, uh, Masters of the Universe, Origins, still need He-Man, still need Battle Cat, still need Prince Adam. Um, what else? Masters of the WWE Universe, uh, Wave 3, haven't seen that yet, so we need all sorts of stuff, as usual. Um... So we're going to start off with uh, two Walmarts, the two in Connecticut that are pretty close to each other, and we will go from there. So I will see you at the first Walmart. Let's go. Let's see if this hot streak continues. <laughs>
this hot streak continues, I just don't know what to say. Um, we found almost all of the Deadpool Strong Guy Wave um, almost in one shot. Uh, we found at the at that first Walmart, we found everything except for Warpath and Sunspot. Um, so we grabbed all of that. I made the decision I'm going to go in on that wave. I want to build him. Seeing him in person, seeing all of his parts in person. I really like his head sculpt on a strong guy. And, um, and a couple of them I'm going to keep. The, uh, a couple of the figures in that wave. I'm not going to keep all of them. I like Blue Deadpool. I like X-Men Deadpool. I like... Uh, um, I like Black Tom Cassidy, um, Maverick looks great, um, so yeah, so, I uh, crossed a bunch of those off the list, I don't know if anyone's listening to me or not, but Green Goblin and Electro sitting right next to those legends, uh, so we grabbed that, um, just crazy, crazy stuff, and then we go to the next spot, uh, we find... Kenner Classics um, Ghostbusters. I don't know if I mentioned that, uh, you know, in the beginning of this video or not, but we need them as well. We found a, a who you gonna call card, the you know one, the the rare card to find. We found Slimer there and Motu Battle Cat. They had a bunch of those. Um, so these WalMarts and I picked up a, a Shy Guy variant uh, Mario Kart um, uh, Hot Wheels. So between both of these WalMarts, just it's the hot streak continues um and to ride that hot hand because i'm gonna shoot until i miss so um we're outside of a target in mount kisco uh i checked pop finder it said they have six beach heads uh so we'll see we're gonna go inside and uh see what they got should be interesting Okay, guys we are right back here um in that target same target parking lot no beachhead but uh wave one joe's which i needed so i picked up every single one of those um there was no one in there except for me and one other guy who was also looking for beachhead um and uh yeah we talked for a while nice guy uh he really wanted beachhead it seems um i get it so do i but he like really wanted it um, and I go to put down, so I'm about to leave, right? My phone goes off. I go to check my phone. So I put down and he saw that I was taking, saw what I was taking, which was all that wave one. So there was one snake eyes left and a scarlet that, you know, I wasn't taking. Uh, but I just took one of each of wave one, had it in my hands. We were talking for a while. He was explaining to me how much he wanted, how badly he wanted beachhead. Um, so I put, I put, I put my haul down. And I, I'm on my phone. I'm like six inches away from everything, in, you know, uh, on the shelf. This guy comes running back and he's like, oh, you know what? I'm just going to pick up a Snake Eyes. He told me that he had ordered one online. He didn't want to wait. I, I don't. He's like, I'm going to pick up a Snake Eyes just in case. And he goes and takes the one that was in my hall, like, and runs away. I'm like, dude, I, you know, I really didn't want to start that conversation in again, honestly. Uh, nice guy, but it was just like, um... He just took it. So 
I took the, you know, there was another snake eye, so I just took that one, but it wasn't the one, you know, there's like little paint defects on the one that I now have, um, that I don't really, that I'm not crazy for. So I don't know if I find a better one out in the wild, I'm going to get it. But, uh, it's just like, dude, what the hell? Anyway, anyway, um, this was still good though. Very good. Uh, no beachhead. I also need, um, Punisher, Marvel Legends, Apocalypse, Toxin. So I don't know if I mentioned that either. Just again, all sorts of shit. But, uh, yeah, so we picked up Wave 1 Joes here, no beachhead. I think the final stop of the day is going to be the Target in the Palisades Mall. Um, really curious to see if they have anything in there. And, uh, and then we'll call it for the day. Okay, we got... Usual Marvel Legends. Some older Crimson Dynamo. No crossbones, obviously. Some AOA. Marvel. Standard peg warming stuff. Someone needs to get that. Grab that Venom. Die cast. I don't see any Joes. Got some Hasbro Ghostbusters. Game reverse two packs. And that's it. Okay, we flipped around the other side. Some how to train your dragon stuff. Star Wars. Oh, what's this? Boba Fett model kit. That's cool. Never seen that. Probe droid. Also very cool. Looks like I have two of those. Some childs, some dinos. This Jurassic Park is actually three and three quarters, actually pretty nice. More dinos. There's some wrestling. Some Valor Ultimates. Chico. How many? There's one, couple of Chicos. Some Series 7. That is it. Alrighty then, so we finally struck out. So I'm actually feeling pretty good about that strikeout because uh, it would have been a little too weird if I walked into this place and just like was showered with more stuff. Um, so good. Uh, got that out of the way. I know I said that this was going to be the last hunt of the day. It's been a long day, but there's a nearby Target and Walmart and I got to stop there. So, and I think I actually... I don't know. That might be the end of this hunt. Um, once I do that, because it'll be, I've been to a million different places today. Uh, I found a good amount of stuff for a haul. So, uh, I don't know. We'll see. We're, so the order of operation will be, uh, next up will be a target in the nearby area and then Walmart. And, uh, let's see what they got. This is getting really, really, really weird. Uh, I guess I had to cool off at uh, Palisades Target because here in Spring Valley, I walk in and you guys saw it, literally unboxing NECA in the NECA section stacked with turtles. So I picked up a, a mutagen pack and um, we are gonna hit one more Walmart uh, today and it'll probably end this video because we have enough for a haul so I'm gonna hit the Walmart nearby and uh, I'll see you over there. We have got uh, Thames, Cobra and 
Raptor. I know some people are using this for uh, gel displays. Seen them all swarm. It's really cool. Relax, please. Um, Dungeons and Dragons. Full set of this thing. Oh, this thing did not show up. Um, Iron Giant. There's more DD up there. And some Minecraft Dungeons. Some Dinos. Plushy Pokemon. Just flip around and check Marvel Legends and everything else. Motu Origins is supposed to be right here. And they are white clean. Some Transformers. What's this? Jetfire? It's pretty cool. Ooh, that Optimus. That was a sucker for Optimus. That's really nice, actually. Okay. WWE Motu. Nope, still wave two. Have not seen wave three yet. Let me know in the comments, guys, if you've seen wave three, wherever you're at. Razzy, whole lot of AJ. Ooh. Must resist. Ook. Some vintage uh, Star Wars up in here. Child, AW ring, that stupid belt. What else? Oh, uh, let's check out these. This is actually Kong Squirrels, cool figure. Godzilla. I like this one. I like this one a lot. Could use this for a diorama for sure. Some sort of a Joe diorama or something. All right, I think that's it. Okie dokie, folks. We are back. Back sooner than expected. It is not a different day. It is the same day. Um, and for those of you, for the uh, the YouTube detectives out there um, that pay very close attention to detail, like uh, the way in which my hair is combed or... Uh, the kind of shirt that I'm wearing or the hat that I'm wearing. Uh, yes, my shirt has changed uh, since we last spoke in the last few hours. Full disclosure, I took a shower. Uh, and I don't typically wear the same shirt, dirty shirt, after I come out of the shower. I'm actually getting ready for that geek show tonight. Uh, shout out to MC. Big shout out to MC for having me on. I'm really looking forward to that. But, uh, yeah, you know, sometimes you change your shirt and it's the same day. And, uh... You keep filming, so that's what's happening right now. And guess what? If you follow me all the way through today, I'm going to change my shirt, spoiler alert, again. Um, but yeah, so anyway, I want to stop wasting time talking about this stupid bullshit. Uh, I wanted to let you guys know it's the same day. Uh, Pop Finder is showing me two Cobra Troopers in White Plains Target, so that's where I'm going. Hopefully, I didn't just waste... Uh, the extra 30 seconds that I need to get these, we're about to find out. See you there. Folks, we are back home here in Boxville, and that concludes another very successful hunt. Um, we've just been finding stuff, and uh, it's been good, um, obviously. So, can't complain. You know, last week we uh, we were hitting lots of targets. This week we hit a mix of. Well, the week before that, we were hitting lots of Walmarts, not really finding stuff at that point. But last week then, we switched focus back to Target um, and started really uh, hitting our stride and finding a lot of different things that, you know, we needed. 
Um, and now we're starting to see stuff turn up this week in, in Walmarts as well around here. Again, let me know in the comments, guys, how you all are faring uh, with these toy hunts for yourselves. You know, are you going after Joes? Are you seeing Joes? Are you going after Turtles? Are you seeing Turtles? Uh, Deadpool wave, strong guy wave, are you guys seeing that? Are you interested in it? Do you like to build a figure? Let me know what you guys are doing down in the comments below. I'd love to know. Um, but with that said, guys, why don't we jump right into it? I am, I'm gonna, speaking of turtles, let's just, because this haul, there's a lot. So, um, as you guys have seen, there's, there's, there's a lot. So why don't we get in, uh, get involved with these turtles here. So we're gonna start, we're gonna jump around. So, um, this is not the first store I visited, obviously, but one of the targets that we hit, uh, this past hunt video, this past week, um, I already got, I already had all the turtles I needed. I, I said in the beginning, the beginning of this video. So, um, but we still wound up seeing Leatherhead and Slash in the Marvel Legends, in the main toy aisle section, which is just unheard of. That's on this channel. I would love to see if anyone else out there, any of you other toy hunters are seeing weird stuff like that. Clearly someone must have just taken it from NECA and then on their way uh, up to the register, were probably like, nah, I don't wanna drop 50 bucks on this and just put it, I don't know, but there were two. So I have no idea, really strange. Um, but we happened to find at one of these targets, uh, not only le uh, Leatherhead and Slash, a couple of those, we saw a couple of the, uh, of the uh, convention shirts. We also found a fresh box. The NECA dude was literally, you could see it I think a little bit in this video, he's still putting stuff on shelves. And he told me that half of the NECA stuff, the turtle stuff was already gone by the time I got there. So, you know, there you have it. But um, we found, the Musical Mutagen Tour four pack. They had three of them. It's crazy that we found this. I had no real plans on getting it, but uh, seeing it in person, this box is menacing. <laughs> and it's turtles, so you know. Got a soft spot. Got a hard on and a soft spot for it. So what, what, what can I really say? I got this really creepy mask cutout that you can use as well, which I will not be using. Um, but yeah, very cool. We found one of these. Um, unexpected. What else did we find? At uh, Walmart, one of the Walmarts we visited, I believe it was a Walmart. Um, yeah, we found the last two of this Spidey Retro Wave, which I'm in love with. This is the only, it's the Green Goblin for me, the only Green Goblin I need. Um, this card is actually really mint. No, it's really mint. I don't know why I'm caring about that. I know why I'm caring, because it's awesome. And, uh, but it's coming off card. That's oh, a little wavy at the bottom, Never mind. so. I'm gonna be happy to open that. See that little wave? I don't know if you can see the wave. Yeah, there you go. Oh yeah. Uh, not that it matters, because this guy's coming off packaging. We found Green Goblin who I was just like so excited to find him in stores and uh, highly anticipating trying to find him. So um, so seeing him right then and there, that Walmart had everything. So we also found uh, same peg. This card's all sorts of beat up. And I think I saw another Electro at um, another Walmart. But uh, yeah, two of these figures that I really needed, so we're done. This one's all sorts of messed up. Again, does not matter. There's a close-up of, of the wave. I have every one I need. I got Spidey on the first uh, go around. Don't have Peter Parker. If I run into him, maybe I'll get him. I'll grab him. Potentially have Daredevil. Uh, don't need Gwen Stacy. And now we have Goblin and Ele uh, Goblin, Green Goblin and Electro. These look awesome. This is just a super cool figure. This is actually really beat up. Oh, it's really beat up. But uh, yeah, these guys look these guys look fantastic. We also found uh, a shy guy variant B Dasher car, Mario Kart. Very happy about that. Also unexpected. He's uh, on the rarer side of things. We found a drive on. I, I just, it's crazy what's been happening lately. I, I don't, it's really crazy. Um, more Walmart goodness. 
slowly chipping away. Not only did we find Slimer, but we found him in the Who You Gonna Call packaging. The rarest card variant for these Kenner Classics Ghostbusters for this line. He looks great. Here's the back. Um, so now we just need, we need Slimer and we need Egon. We need Spengler and then we're good for now. So again, chipping away. It's really funny, like this line, I, I had to chip away at it. Uh, Spider-Man Retro chipped away at that. Um, Masters of the Universe Origins, we're chipping away at that. We found Skeletor uh, a few weeks ago. And most recently we found a ton of these. So I took one. Battle Cat looks phenomenal. Guys, if you are a Masters of the Universe fan, you, it's, you need this. All of it. You need all of this. Let me know in the comments below if you guys have been seeing this. If you've been seeing this wave at Walmarts. I've seen guys hitting, you know, finding Beastman, finding all of it. You know, uh, up to this point, I've seen Skeletor and Battle Cat. And uh, this over here. That's what I've picked up, so, uh, from that line so far. So there's that. One wave, so this is, we're talking about chipping away at some of these waves that we need. Um, the polar opposite of that is finding everything in one shot. Uh, and that is the Strong Guy Deadpool wave. Um, I hadn't seen any of them at all up to this point a few days ago. Um, and then we hit this one Walmart. They had, you know, a, a lot of the stuff you're seeing now. And they also had almost every figure from the Strong Guy Build-A-Figure wave. Um, so we have all of them except Sunspot. We'll get that soon. Pirate Deadpool, I'm not crazy about this. And I'm not keeping all of these. Um, I'm just, I, you know, I bought... Bought this way for the for a couple of figures that I wanted, which I'll show you here. I'll show you my favorites, my top picks out of these uh, out of this wave. This is not one of them. Um, this pirate Deadpool. Uh, don't know. Shikla, which I like too. I don't know. This is actually a this is an excellent figure. It's just really preference for me. Um, I don't know that I'm keeping this one, but I do think this is a really, really nice figure. Here's the wave, by the way. Although I'm sure you guys are very aware of it. Um, oh, I just did that. Anyway, he's here. Next, this one is a keeper. Maverick, got that OG Maverick in the collection now. He looks awesome. And this is my favorite from this wave. This is a super dope figure, X-Men. We got Deadpool. Blue Deadpool, X-Men Deadpool. Whatever you want to call him. He looks great. So we have him. And last but not least, this is another, this is my, these are, these, these are my two favorites right here out of this wave. Right here. Blue Deadpool, Black Tom Cassidy. Love the staff. Might put him next to my juggernaut. I don't know what I'm doing, but he's, I'm keeping him. He's awesome. Really, really, really cool figure, in my opinion. I also, actually, I'm gonna start putting this stuff back in. Um, so that's, that was, these were all from one Walmart. So at this point, as you guys have seen in this video, I needed Warpath and Sunspot. We did not find Sunspot, but we did find Warpath at the, I think it was the next Walmart I went to. Yeah. So we're just missing Sunspot. Um, another great figure. Uh, I am on the fence about keeping him though. 
I just um, I just really want to keep keep things right and tight, you know. Like I said, great figure. I just I don't know. Maybe I'll use parts for. Maybe I'll make like a a mock figure or something. Out of some of his parts, it looks like they could be could be good for. I don't know. Um, so that's that's that. Uh, that I forget which target it was. Oh, so we go. I at one point I think the last thing we did. Uh, because I feel I'm filming this haul uh, the day after uh, Actually two days after um, I think we finished we wrapped all this stuff up. It's been a crazy work week um, And I just haven't been able to break down the haul. So I think our last trip uh, Was a was target in White Plains um, Pop finder told me about Cobra Trooper. So I was like, I think that was what it was um, uh, yeah, and so what I had not looked up, which was a really pleasant surprise, and I was just like kind of floored when I saw it, and in person, it's got some nice weight to it too. Deluxe figure, Marvel Legends Apocalypse. Guys, this guy is one of the best figures out there right now, no question. Got some really nice weight to it. Looks so cool. That AOA Apocalypse. Super duper happy to have this in the collection. This is really, really cool. I'm still building out the most recent Marvel Legends Apocalypse uh, Build-A-Figure. It's a little older. Um, so I'm slowly but surely piecing that together. Uh, but we found that, so that's nice. That's a big one to cross off the list. And then of course, we also found what could be, oh, someone slashed the shit out of this. Look at this. Whatever, these are hard to find. Um, but this could be my favorite Joe. Let me know in the comments what your favorite G.I. Joe classified figure is up to this point. Um, tough tough call, tough decision. I don't have Beachhead in hand, but he looks like he's going to be my favorite. Uh, but up to this point, I'd probably say, I really like Snake Eyes, but I'd probably say mm, Red Ninja and these guys, Cobra Troopers. We found two of them. Very happy to find these. The only two I've, I found, obviously, any more that I find you guys would be the first ones to know. So we found two. I'm going to be army building. So we have two of these, and uh, I'm gonna be army building with uh, red ninjas if I can find more too. So uh, very, very happy with these pickups. These look super duper awesome. Get these if you can. I got the DPCI in this video for you. So go to Pop Finder, hit up Pop Finder and, and check it. Just keep checking it until uh, you know something hits. And if you see, like I said, if you see more than a quantity of one, um, go hit that target. Speaking of targets, we also went to a target in Mount Kisco to try and find Beachhead. We did not find Beachhead. We found uh, another human being who really wanted Beachhead, uh, who wound up taking my snake eyes out of my haul. Long story, go rewind back to the video. Um, if you want details on that. Anyway, um, no beachhead, but they had all of, all of wave one, uh, which I didn't have. So first time seeing it, first time on this channel showing it. But, uh, oh, this is also one of my favorites too. I mean, we got Destro, super duper awesome. Uh, we got Roadblock. So now we have Cobra Island. N wave one roadblock, classic. Looks great. I really like. I actually do really like a lot of these wave one figures too, man. I don't. I mean, I think I just I saw Duke first. Speaking of which, here he is, and he, and he does look good. Again, I feel like his his face, his head portrait is nice. It is good. Um, I don't know if it's a little more modernized than I needed to be, uh, but um, overall, it's a great figure. I love his his body sculpt. Everything else looks looks really good. That's Duke, we've all seen him. Safe to say he's uh, probably called, classify him as a, no pun intended, classify him as a, uh, as a common. And my paint defected snake eyes. I'm probably gonna try to find another one of these. I'm just crazy. What I'm talking about is like the silver on his buckle. One of his buckles is kind of like, not kind of like, it's just not there. Um, I don't know, I'm crazy. Anyway, um, and the other thing we found was another Mario Kart variant, Blue Yoshi. I didn't even know this existed. 
I guess I wasn't paying attention, I don't know. But we found blue Yoshi, so now we have green, blue, dark blue, uh, uh, black, uh, pink. So we've got plenty of Yoshis here, check that out. Very cool. And uh, that's it guys, so that's the haul. Uh, Marvel Legends AOA Apocalypse, Wave 1 Joes, Koopa Trope, Koopa. <laughs> Cobra, Trooper, Joe's, uh, Kenner Classic, Slimer, Masters of the Motu Origins, Battle Cat, just about all of the Deadpool, uh, Strong Guy Wave, um, Marvel Legends, Spider-Man Retro, Musical Mutagen Tour, a couple of Mario Kart uh, cars, Hot Wheels. This was a gigantic, gigantic haul. Um, and I'm super happy with all of it. You know, we've been finding stuff left and right, so I hope you guys are too. Uh, and I hope you guys enjoyed this hunt. We, uh, we will be right back out on it, uh, on that hunt immediately, effective immediately. So I'm hoping to bring you guys another something uh, good, uh, you know, next week. We'll see. And, but until then guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this haul. I hope everyone is doing well uh, from myself and this freaking disaster, Boxville. Uh, and Lord Boxbro, wherever he is, I think he's sleeping. Uh, we will see you on the next one. Peace.